some coal e-e-o I don't know what the rest of the song e-e-e-i-o What's up guys, it's Fathom here, welcome back to another episode of Sky Factory. I know it has been a while, it's been about a week, but the reason why I've not been recording Sky Factory is about, was it four, four or five days ago, uh, well four or five days ago, no, six days ago I did a live stream, it was about like a two hour live stream, which I will get into that, because I did do a few things, I didn't do any of the challenges, but I went and checked the, the deep storage and we got more than one million cobblestone. But I haven't checked it off yet, but we'll go ahead and check that out. Uh, so I can actually show you guys. But, uh, yeah, about four or five days ago, the launcher, the the guys who did the developers, well, basically, whoever in, in the launcher, moved the ho like the main host, like the main launcher. They changed the different developer for the to actually host it. Uh, it was Creeper host, but now it is Nodecraft. And when they switched it over, apparently there was a bug that caused the old launcher to read as a virus. Uh, don't know why, have no clue. It was all over the forums and they they said they were working on it, they don't know why. They said just go ahead and update to the new one because when they moved the launcher, they had to update it. So that's probably what caused it and made it to where the other launcher didn't work. So for some odd reason, my, at least mine, I don't know if it was happening to anyone else, but everybody else said it automatically deleted it. Mine was like, oh, it's a virus, blah, 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 and it deleted it. Um, but then when I went to go download it, it was just nothing but downloader. I don't know if it's because everybody tried to do it all at once and Nodecraft couldn't handle it and it crashed. I have no clue. Couldn't get it to work. Now I got it, I finally tried to get it to work. Because I was playing some Hunger Games and oh my god, I was trying to get some recordings for Hunger Games and I just, nothing. I couldn't get, it wasn't, some of them were just right off the bat, I died. Someone got an iron sword right off the bat in the, in the chest, that was, that was ridiculous. And then there was a team of two, apparently now there is an invis hack going around. We literally get to the spot where we have to do the deathmatch, they would not show up. They were not on my screen at all, I was running around, they weren't there, and all of a sudden I just started getting smacked. I'm looking around, holy crap, this guy was just here. There was two of them, there's no way, I know that I am, I have a 20-20 vision, there is no way that I missed 20 people running around in circles at least twice. I would have seen them. And then all of a sudden, they died, like, I died, and they were disappeared on my screen again. I don't know if it's a, it had to have been a hack. I have absolutely, it's some kind of script. Either that or my, my game's just screwing up significantly. But it, I mean, it very well could be, because they updated to 1.8 for Mineplex, and they added more servers, which is all cool and all well. But they didn't fix the servers that they had before. When they had too many people on to almost max, it was so laggy. And it's still so lag. I wish they would find a way to fix that before they add more servers. That would that would be great. But anyway, so that's what I've been doing for the last hour. And I was trying to explain that I built the ME system. If you guys don't know what the ME, it's the Applied Energetics uh, way of storage. So basically, all my stuff, basically is right here now not everything has been transported I don't have it hooked up for that stuff to transport I'll end up having an ender tank and then from the or not the ender tank uh, ender chest and everything will be going into the ender chests and then it will go from there and it'll be pumped through there this is the ME drive these are these are the only drives that I could build this took so much resources guys like you don't even have any clue like actually you know what I'm just gonna go ahead and show you ME 4k for just these alone this is it. This looks simple, but then you go to this, and then you know, like, you know, that doesn't look too bad. Each one of these, you need one of these. And then these, you need to, you need to smelt that. And then from there is that. So you need a lot of silicone. Let me just put it, let me put it, and then you need three of those. And then you need another one, so you actually need four of these, and then you need that. And the quartz knife is actually not that bad because it's actual, it's got actual durability. It doesn't just take one and then it's used, so been using a lot of resources 
Uh, but the mob we're actually going to get into today is uh, magical crops. I should have gotten into this a lot earlier than I did because we're kind of kind of behind on the magical crops. Uh, went to the nether, which is good because I didn't die. So actually, I did kind of die. Uh, I lost my uh, I lost my armor. My uh, yeah, I lost my armor, which kind of sucked. But uh, I think I have enough forcing to make it. Actually, do I? I'm still hitting Q for a run, and that doesn't not work on 1.614. Uh, do I still have my? Oh yes, I built this armor. Which, I can go ahead and put that on, because we don't need to. Uh, this is the armor that we're going to use to fly. This is the force armor. And as you see, why is that? Okay, the bar is charging. That's good. But, uh, yeah, we're going to be using this armor. This is the armor that we need to fly, but we need to get it to tier 4. These are on, like, tier nothing. So, actually, let me go. The first thing that we do to get this uh, is actually sugar. Uh, do I have sugar cane? I don't have any sugar cane in my thing. So let me go ahead and get some sugar cane here real quick. I'm going to need four. Thank you. Turn that into sugar. And then we go over ha. And I should... Yeah. I'm going to put sugar on these. This will give me speed. So bam. Let's go ahead and use that up here real quick. I got plenty of liquid force. I have a lot of liquid force. I got a lot of broken shards from the uh, spoils bags. Which, I don't know if I've even... Uh, have I shown you guys that? Can I leave that in there? Okay. So let me just go ahead and show you how much spoil stuff that I got. I've actually cleaned out a lot of it, but holy crap. Holy crap. That is so much stuff. Um... We need it. There is a challenge that we need to get a, a village large enough to spawn an iron golem. What I have in these two uh, safari nets, which the safari net allows you to capture a a mob or an NPC. Some of them are single use. You can make ones that aren't that will be able to hold it and they don't destroy themselves once you use it. But these right here, these are zombie villagers. I was able to capture two of them, which was great. What I did was this down here below below us. Uh, I also uh, fixed or I didn't fix, but I finished the platform underneath us. Uh, but right down here, this was actually not... Hi. This was actually not like this. This was just a normal uh, dirt platform. And it was just using to spawn mobs so that I can get a zombie villager. And I got two of them. You need two of them because obviously you need them to be able to mate and all that. All that fun stuff. We're actually going to get to that probably pretty soon because from here now it's just build. It's just it's just build the platform that we need, and I might actually end up turning it into a uh, an iron golem farm, so an iron so we can get iron ingots and stuff like that. It's actually pretty simple. I'm pretty sure it works on 1.6.4. But look how much cobblestone we have: one million seven hundred fifty-seven thousand. That is insane, and that meets the the challenge. So did I did I accidentally mark it off or no? Nah? Uh, no, store one million cobblestone in deep storage. There we go. That is done. Yes, 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 yes. Awesome. Let's go ahead and finish this up here real quick, and then we will be on our way. This is getting plenty of power, so that is good. And you guys are going to flip out after you see how fast I'm going to run after this. Uh, I was about to say, I'm pretty sure that works. But apparently not. Uh, why do I have Thaumian ingots in my... I don't even know. Okay, let's go ahead and throw you on. Look how fast we move. And this is without even running. This is without even running. This is with running. And this is just speed one. Look at this. Oh my gosh, look how far I jumped to. Hold on. Let me find enough space. Oh, yeah. That is awesome. Okay. I'm assuming shift is like almost normal walk. Yeah. Okay. So this platform... Oh, good lord. that That's touchy. Uh, if I take one off, does that fix it? Uh, barely. Okay. Uh, let me... Uh, <laughs> I don't hit the platforms for this. Yeah, I can go right up that. Uh, this might... I might end up having to turn all this into... Uh, my my ear really itches, and I don't know why. But uh, I might have to turn all this into stone 
cobblestone, whatever they're called. You you guys know what I'm talking about. I don't really use them that much in, like, anything, so I, that's probably why I don't remember what the name of them are. But, okay, we're going to get into magic crops. Uh, the things we need to build, actually, I'm going to build a watering can. Uh, I believe that's what it is. Uh, watering... Uh, watering can. Yeah. Um, watering can empty, watering can... Well, obviously, I don't want to make that. So, it's four stone, a bowl, and a piece of bone meal. Or, what we can do is... I believe this works. So, we need a tank. I don't remember how to make a tank, to be quite honest with you. It's been a while. Uh, it would have to be glass panes. Okay. Um, and obsidian, which I have obsidian, so that's not too bad. Uh, do I have any glass panes by chance? I do. Uh, ah, no, they're in chisel, though. That should be fine. I can unchisel it and turn it back to normal glass, uh, glass pane. And obsidian. I don't have any obsidian. Okay. Uh, stone... I need one, two, three, four. Was it four or five? We'll do five just in case. And one, two, three to make a bowl. There we go. Makes four bowls. I only need one. You can go in there. Uh, let me get my chisel out. You. Uh, get that in my hand here. Put you back to normal. There we go. That is back to normal. And then we need to make obsidian. So let me get my water bucket. Go over here. Oh, good lord, that is touchy. That is extremely touchy. Maybe I shouldn't have done speed. Maybe that was not a good idea. But, uh, oh well. It is what it is. We'll work with it. We will work with it. Hopefully I don't die. Now now that I said it, I actually probably jinxed it. But that's, that's besides the point. Okay, there we go. We got that. And then we need a piece of bone meal. Uh, does it happen? I have 140. Good lord, that's a lot of bone meal. <laughs> that's actually a lot of wood, too. I got some diamonds, which is awesome. A lot of bones. A lot of arrows, guys. That is a ton. That is a ton of arrows. We got a lot of we got a lot of coal, too, which is good. Uh, okay, anyway. Back to this. So it was that, 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 and that. Why did... Why did it say I have to put... Oh, peaceful mode only. Why, why is there a difference? <laughs> why is there a difference? Okay, so we're going to use the watering can. And if that's not fast enough, what we can also use, we can also make a sprinkler system. And that's what the tanks are for. So we need a redstone torch. I actually have iron bars, which is cool. Uh, but I don't have a lot of iron, believe it or not. I actually have just enough iron. Good lord. Oh my gosh, where did all my resources go? Uh... Seriously. Another reason why we need an iron farm. Uh, because I cannot apparently... Uh, no, let me let me actually take all that back. I need to make the redstone torch real quick. There we go. Bam, bam. Let's do that. Get the sprinkler. Put you, you, and you back in there. We need you for that. We don't need... Well, actually, we need to fill... We need to fill this tank up. First, what we're going to do is we're going to find somewhat of the center. Um, probably right there. Oh, did I actually get that back? No, I did not. Okay. And then what we do is we fill this up with water. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to do this 16 times, which is amazing. So I will see you guys in just a second. All right, guys. I, was, I just decided I was just going to go ahead and fill it up like halfway or something because we're actually not going to use this source. What we're going to use is the watering can. And to fill up the watering can, all you do is right-click a water source. And it should work and then you just bam you just you just right click and hopefully this will grow now how do you get magic or crop stuff well basically you just break uh grass normal grass so i just got bone meal went over to the animal farm area and uh got a whole bunch of seeds but there we go this is the seed that you really need to start actually being able to grow objects like different things not food but actual objects like coal iron diamonds emeralds stuff like that you need an essence crop and you need a lot of them because you need to make a lot of essence so basically you just break them and very rarely do you actually apparently very rarely do you ever get two seeds it usually takes a lot of people a lot of time and what you usually get is essence dust and nature essence now magical 
Pops. Let me type that in. What we're going to be working towards, and uh, there will be a lot of cutting and editing here, uh, which is fine because it does actually take a while for some of these to grow and stuff like that. But I will be make sure to highlight most of the other stuff, uh, most of the important stuff as far as that goes. But uh, what we need to be starting working is we need to start working towards the infusion stones. And we start out with the week one. You need to surround it by a diamond and essence dust. So that's why we just need to keep growing. That gets a weak infusion stone. And then from there, okay, the weak infusion stone can be used to grow coal. Okay. From there, and you need to line that with, I think, four pieces of coal, uh, the essence, the nature essence, and then the weak infusion stone. The good thing about the infusion stones are that it doesn't actually use it in the crafting recipe. It uses it in the crafting recipe, but you get it back. So that's a good thing. So you start out the weak, and then you go to the regular. And from the regular, you need coal essence. Where do you get coal essence? Well, you get it from the coal crop. So then you got to start growing cro or coal crops. So then you go from there. You get the coal essence, the same thing. You get the regular, and so on from there. Uh, and I don't remember, I believe, what after what's after coal. I don't remember. I don't remember if that's iron next or not. We'll see here. Uh, no, it's redstone. Uh, redstone, glowstone... Uh, or obsidian, which we already have a source of obsidian, so we don't need to do that at all. We have a fast way of getting obsidian, so we won't do it that way. We'll probably do redstone, because I don't really need glowstone, I don't think. I don't really, I don't think I need a lot. Of, if we do, we can go ahead and start growing it once we get to that point. But then we get redstone, and then from there, we need to get iron. So what we're working towards is a strong infusion, uh, or... What I really want to do is get a master, and that way we can get diamond essence and emerald essence, and that will be absolutely awesome. But so we're going to start out with the weak. So we need eight essence and a diamond or an emerald, and it just really kind of depends on which one I have more of, really. So let me go ahead and water these. I'm going to fast forward. Basically, I'm just going to go ahead and cut, edit until I actually get these to grow. This one is glitched, so actually give me a second. Apparently, this can happen where they don't grow depending on wherever they are. There we go. That works. And this also uh, waters the grass, so I can actually grow stuff with this too. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and get these to grow. Let me get enough essence or essence dust, and we will be right back. All right? All right, guys. I went ahead and I got about 22 essence. That's good enough to uh, good enough to start, but we actually need weak essences. And I happen to get one dropped, and the nature essence is actually kind of cool. If you hit U on the thing, it actually shows you all the crafting recipes. This is what's used to make moss, moss stone, mossy uh, stone. You can make vines, you can make lily pads. Uh, mycelium, I don't know if we need mycelium for any of the challenges, but if we can, then there we go. I was actually kind of wondering whether it was able to be made, but apparently you can make it with magical crops. Which is a cool thing, so we might end up having to use that. I don't even know. And then magic fertilizer, which I don't know whether I don't know what that is, but I believe it instantly makes everything. I don't I don't even know what the magic fertilizer is, to be quite honest with you. And then magical food, which you just surround it with a whole bunch of other magical crops, and uh, makes magical food gives you four, which is three hunger and health regeneration three, which that's actually kind of cool. Uh, but okay, let's go ahead and uh we'll go ahead and make this here so we actually need what do we have more of i don't even think i have any emeralds i do but i guess we're gonna stick with the diamond for now so let's go ahead and get the one diamond we do that and then if we do that we get a weak infusion stone and from here what we need to do is we need to put the weak infusion stone and we need to surround that wait that didn't work oh how how on go to you uh, go over, no, no, how do we make that, oh, never mind, sorry, it's not surrounded, it's just the four, my bad, bam, there we go, we make another weak essence, now we're going to need two more of those, luckily, I have enough to do so, but we're probably going to go ahead and need more, so I'll probably go ahead and grind that, edit that part out, but uh, okay, so from here, what we need to do, is to get the coal essence. Uh, let me go ahead and... Wait, what What did that make? Oh, goes back to essence stones. Okay. To make the coal essence... Uh, wrong direction. We need four coal, a regular seed, and then four of these. And then we will get a coal seed. So let me go ahead and do that. Let me go ahead and get four coal. One, two, three, four. 
and a normal seed. Bam. We'll do that. Surround it by coal. Do that. Do that. And there we go. We got our first coal seed. Yes. Okay. So let me go ahead and go. Let me go ahead and go. Let me go ahead and plant that. We'll work on getting more essence dust, get more of those weak essences, so we can get more coal seeds. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. We'll pro I'll probably work with the sprinkler system now because it's actually going to get bigger. So let me go ahead and, well, um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We'll do it like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And let me move that torch. Uh, like so. Calm down. Okay. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. That actually kind of worked, which is kind of weird. But okay, so we'll put the coal. Why did you? Why? Why are you being stupid? Uh, let me put the sprinkler on. Okay, I know. Oh, there we go. Ha ha! There we go. Look at that. And it works just like it should. It's it's a sprinkler, which I think is kind of cool. Uh, how much water does does that use up? That's using up a lot of water. Good lord. Okay, let me go ahead and fill this up with water real quick. We'll go ahead and start planting. I should probably put the I should probably put the seed down. That would have been the smart thing to do. So let me go ahead and get some more coal seeds, guys, so we can actually work on the next part. And I will see you guys in just a second. All right. All right, guys. There we go. We got some coal essence. We should have enough to go ahead. What are you? doing here what 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 why 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 were you there okay that was kind of weird uh reason why i'm not uh i'm not running so fast because i don't have the force cap on because apparently it also makes me mine faster and dirt almost gets destroyed instantly and i might or might not have lost a few dirt blocks so uh yeah so uh, i took those out so that i could uh do this but okay what i do want to check out before i start doing this uh i need to see how many crops i can actually grow with just a weak infusion so actually let me look up weak infusion weak uh I could have just hit you on this thing and would have been completely done and wouldn't even have to worry about it. Okay, so weak infusion, what can I do? I can make a regular infusion. Uh, I can make weak essence. Uh, I can use dye essence, water essence to make regular. Don't have any of those. Fire essence. I don't even know how to get these. Uh, what? And they don't have crafting recipes, which is kind of weird. Uh, okay. Uh, so weak infusion. Uh, hit Y. So basically, it's made just to make uh, weak essences and regular infusion stones. So we're going to need a few more essence dust, I think. Let me see. How many of what do I have? Uh, I just need one more. Okay. So let me go ahead and do that. Actually, I'm going to just go ahead and make a whole bunch of them. And by a whole bunch, I mean three. But still, that's better than any. Uh, so do that. Uh, no, what am I doing? Okay, so to make that, we need to surround that, like so. And then with a regular infusion stone, what can we do with that? We can make regular essence. Okay. So what do we do with regular essence? Well, regular essence is made to make strong essence, which then is in turn used for what? To make extreme, to make extreme essence, and then extreme is to make the diamond seed, which is what we're actually going for. Uh, so we need the diamond seed. So we need extreme essences. Wow. Okay. Uh, so let's go back just a little bit. Uh, weak infusion. Uh, hit you. Gosh darn it. Go back to inventory. Go back to inventory. Hit you. So now we have the regular. What can we use regular for? Let's see. How do we make redstone? Because we are going to need that. Uh, to make redstone essence, we need a regular infusion stone. Uh, oh, wow. Uh, that's kind of cool. You can make red bricks. Uh, redstone block. How do we actually make the essence, though? Uh, I want to see how, how do you make the essence? Or the crop. Let me, let me rephrase that. How do we make the crop? Uh, is the crop the same as 
How do we make the crop? Okay, let me get a normal seed. We get four redstone. We get a normal seed. And see if that works. So bam, 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 and bam, and then bam. No? How do we make a... Do I have to make... Let me take the regular infusion stone. Ah, I know what we need to do. We need to get regular essence. And then from regular essence, I believe, then we need redstone. So I actually need more materials. Ugh. All right, guys, I will be right back. Let me go ahead and start growing some more stuff, and then we will hopefully get the redstone crop. So I will see you guys in just a second again. All right, come on. I'm almost there. I need 12 of them. So there we go. Uh -huh. Is that going to give me enough? Uh, uh, 11? Actually, yeah, this should be enough. I totally... <laughs> Oh, let me just there. Okay, so let's go ahead and make some more weak or more natural. Let's go make some more regular essence. That was the word I was looking for. Uh, so we need the weak infusion. And we do that. And I need 12. Do that. That and that. Okay, so those. How did we make the regular essence again? I don't remember how we made the. Oh, never mind. I remember now. Uh, there we go. Take the weak infusion out. Make the regular. There we go. Now we have regular essence. Now let's see if this fixes that. I do that. And then I do a normal seed. I do that. There we go. Yes. We got the redstone seed. Yes. Okay. So there we go. Now we have the redstone seed. Now that we can grow redstone. After that. Now what we need is no get out of that okay uh nope go to you okay so now we need to make the strong infusion so now we need redstone essence so we went from normal essence weak essence to coal essence and now to redstone essence so then we need to make strong infusion and then from strong infusion i'm assuming we probably need oh we can make obsidian too uh, well, we don't need, really need the obsidian, but we can make glowstone essence. How do we make glowstone? Oh, we're going to need glowstone dust. And we can kind of do the same thing. Hmm. Hmm. Ha ha. I don't think it... Oh, I do have glowstone dust. Oh, so we can make we can make more glowstone dust. And we can also make obsidian, but again, I don't really need to make obsidian. I and mean, I'll be completely honest. Uh, I don't need the, the infusion stone at the moment. So there we go. We're going to need to get more essence dust... We're going to have to get more of that and a whole bunch of other stuff. But this is basically just a touch on how this works as far as magical crops. So now we're going to go to redstone seeds. That is the next thing. Yip, yip, hooray. So we have normal. We have coal. Coal will go there. So then now we plant our redstone. And come on. Let's grow. Come on grow. I'm also using a watering can. I don't actually think the sprinkler is working, to be quite honest, because I haven't noticed any change as far as speed goes. Now, the watering can is running, particle effect. It's raining, and the sprinkler is going on. These things should be growing instantly. Like, these things are getting so much water. Alright, so there we go. We got our redstone essence. Then we will go ahead and make the regular infusion stone which will be awesome. Again, we will get that stone back, so we can actually use the regular infusion to make our glowstone. So we'll go ahead and keep the regular. We don't really need the weak one because it doesn't really grow anything that we really, really are looking for. So there we go. Let's get this redstone going. I'm going to go ahead and continue growing this, guys. I will see you guys in just a second. All right, guys. I should have enough here to go ahead and make... I think I just need one more. Well, let me just go ahead and uh, make a whole bunch of them because that would be the smart thing. There we go. Not going to be enough, obviously, to make like a whole bunch. But so now what we take is the regular. Right? Yes. Oh, excuse me. And then we take that. We make two more. That is enough for the regular essence. <sighs> now that is enough for one strong essence and there we go we got a strong essence now what do we need the strong essence for this makes a lot more 
This makes a lot more. So here we go. We have 18 pages. So we can either make extreme essence, which is not what we're working toward. Well, we are ev eventually going to, which will, we need the extreme essence for diamonds. But one, we can grow iron. Awesome. Two, gold, blaze rods, ender pearls, lapis lazuli. We can actually make an experience C, which is absolutely awesome. Uh, nether brick. I'm probably not going to build much with nether anyway, so yeah so so on that one leather i kind of feel weird that that one's strong because leather i can get from cows like easily i don't understand why i would grow that i can get le leather a lot quicker same thing with gunpowder so we're not gonna do that magma cream that's awesome bones that seems extremely useless that seems like an extremely useless uh magical crop i don't know maybe it's not maybe it does something else that i don't oh skeleton seeds oh i grow the souls of them oh that's what i used to make spawners oh okay i get it now never mind i wasn't reading that correctly i thought it made leather it doesn't it actually makes so actually no that makes more sense so creeper uh Okay, that makes a lot more sense. So then a spider, then a slime, uh, gas, good lord. Uh, now we can make f potions. You need the four potions, but with the seed, it actually makes potions, which is absolutely awesome. It's got the water breathing, which we really don't need. Uh, strength, fire regeneration, regeneration, night vision. Uh, and then it has the different other ones, like the silver, the lead, the tin, the lead, the... I already said that. The Certus Quartz, the Aluminum. It has all bunch of the. It has the Force, which is that. That one's actually kind of cool. Um, Furious, which actually is a really cool because Furious actually takes a few elements to actually make. And then the Air Shards, which are in Thumbcraft. I'm not 100% sure how to get the shards. So once we get them, we can actually start growing them. Depending on how hard it is to actually get them, that might actually be pretty cool. And we'll knock out all those shards. But the one we're mainly focusing on is the iron ingot. But I need to get more essence, strong essences. So let me go ahead and get that, guys. Let me go ahead and cut and edit. I'll be right back. We'll get some more of that. And yeah, sweetness. Let me go ahead and get some more essences, a lot more essences, actually. And I will see you guys in just a second. All right, come on. Let's see if we can get just a few more here. Maybe, maybe so. So, probably grinded for about a good while. And uh, out of all the essence, I got a whole bunch of essence. But I literally had like 53 with about 12 weak essences coming from there. And I was only able to make one strong essence with two left over. So, good lord, I need so much. Actually, this might actually be enough. Hold on. This might actually be enough. Let me, my, my, my math might have been failing at me on that one. So, there we go. Um, let me take the regular. I actually might have more than enough. Bam. Put that in there. Put that in there. Yeah, there we go. Actually, I just had barely enough. Never mind. There we go. Uh, regular, why are you, no, never mind, sorry, put the strong in there, bam, there we go, now we got four of those, oh, good lord, the strong essence, I cannot believe it, then we get to extreme essence, and I'm just gonna need hundreds and thousands of these, not really, I'm gonna need hundreds and hundreds of this essence dust, which means I'll probably grow this, I don't, I only got the, the coal crop, to uh expand so this will probably be turned into essence redstone i can get fairly easy i'll probably turn that into essence and i'll pro probably this will be all essence because i'll have iron uh down here where the thing is here that i showed you guys i'm going to have iron growing down there so this will be separate like iron diamond and then once we start in getting into spawners, I'll probably start building, just switching those in and out, whatever we want to actually start breeding. But okay, so let's go ahead and make our diamond, or make our iron. Hopefully I have enough. I have no iron, but there we go. I can go ahead and just make some of that. Bam. And do I have any iron cooking by chance? I do. There we go take that <clears throat> let's go ahead and make our first iron seed oh 
my gosh, guys. This was the main one that I was going to hopefully get to today, and I did, which is awesome. So let me go ahead and actually get that. I need to get a seed out of here. There we go. How's my inventory doing, actually? Uh, that's kind of... Those are halfway full. Those That's about a third away full, and that's not even been used yet. Sweet! Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh, by the way, you guys are probably... This is the power. This is the controller. How is this getting power? I totally forgot to show you guys that. It's not actually getting powered by this. I thought about it. But I actually made my own separate one down here. And these right here are transfer nodes, but it's an energy transfer node. These things are not that expensive, but they're kind of expensive. And generators. I'm going to line these all with generators eventually. And uh, here's the cobblestone generator. But I'm going to line these all up eventually. And then I'll put all my mechanic stuff, some of my mechanic stuff over here. And all that other stuff right there is going to move. And if you're wondering why that stone slabs, uh, well, or cobblestone slabs, well, for some odd reason there's some glitch that uh, the steam, I guess, was rising up and it actually started burning this. Which was not cool, because it burned very, very, very quickly. Slabs burn very quickly, apparently. And, uh... So that's why I did that. So none of none of these were burning. So I just went ahead and I built that little thing. That's why this is actually kind of different. But that's really all I did in the live stream. I really didn't do much other than that. But okay. So let's go ahead and do that. That... And that, and yes, we got our iron seed. Yes. Okay. Now you're probably wondering, well, how do you actually grow the iron? You actually need nine essences to make how many? Uh, well, now I need a strong essence. Let me go back to strong essence. Strong essence. Go back to, oh, good lord. Okay. Go back to strong essence. Hit you on that. Then you're like, okay, well, how do you make iron? Iron. Or, well, actually, let me go to iron. That's a lot quicker to do it that way. Oops. Iron. So how do we make iron? Good question. By none of those ways. Uh, uh <laughs> That was actually not what we were looking for. It, I, huh, that's weird. It doesn't actually show the essences. So I'm going to show iron essence. Okay, there, what happens is if we put all iron essence in the eight, we get eight iron ore. And then from there, we can smell that. Yes. And, oh, we can also surround a strong with the extreme, so we need to make the extreme. We can also make essence block iron, so we can make iron blocks and stuff like that, which is actually kind of cool. Uh, ooh, that actually, eh, I don't know. I don't, iron wood? Nice. Okay, so there we go. This is what the iron essence will be for. And same thing with the redstone. It makes the, the redstone. And uh, actually, I think that's actually nine. And then you get like 14 or certain amount of redstone. But this is good. We can get our iron. And we can actually grow a lot quicker once we get it into the farm. But let's go ahead and place that down. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys. So there we go. We have our iron crop. I'm probably going to go ahead and end the episode here. Next episode... We will work towards the diamond. Actually, we're probably not going to work towards the diamond. I'm going to go ahead and grind, and we're going to get to that diamond seed, which will be absolutely phenomenal. And at that point, oh, man, I got to do a whole bunch. But you basically get the process. So from here, we go from uh, strong to extreme. So let's go to extreme. It's the same process, so we're going to need regular essence. Now we need to take strong essences, surround that with the strong infusion, and bam, we'll get the extreme. So, what can we do with extreme? We can make diamonds, which that is what we are working for or towards, guys. So we got one more step as far as essences go, and then we can we can start making diamonds, which is absolutely awesome. That is the goal. Iron and diamonds, that is the goal for magical crops for me, other than um, being able to make uh, spawners. That is what we're going to also be working towards. But the main thing for me right now is the iron, because we need so much iron. I really do need a lot of iron, and I have not been getting as much iron, and I feel like I probably should getting be, I should be getting a lot more iron than I am, and... At the moment, I don't feel like my things are... My, this tool right here and this over here. I don't think it's as efficient. 
as I would like it to be. Are these out of hammers? Yes, they are. Okay. That's why the coal's there. Oops. I need to put more hammers in there. But, okay. So, there we go. I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here, guys. If you enjoyed, remember to slap that like button. Greatly appreciate it, guys. I know it's been about a week or so since uh, I recorded. But, again, the the moving the host for some odd reason caused my launcher to pretend it was a virus. I don't know why. Don't know why. But I got it fixed. Finally got the thing to be able to download. I guess maybe they were just overloading the servers or whatever because so many people are trying to do it. Don't know. But it works now. Saves good. I'm growing crops. Yeah. If you guys enjoy, slap that like button. Greatly appreciate it. And if you're new to my channel, as always, just hit the subscribe button. I don't know. I don't. As it is going, I don't know whether I'm going to hit 1,000 subscribers before the end of the year. But if we can hit 1,000 subscribers, 1K, guys, I will be so, so appreciative. No joke, guys. You have no clue how much 1,000 subscribers would mean to me, guys. It's, it's a phenomenal uh, milestone. And it's one of the hardest ones to get. Your first 1,000 for most YouTube channels are just unheard of. But hitting 1,000, guys, would be absolutely appreciative. Really, really, really. You guys are awesome. Thank you guys for so much support. Thank you for guys who have stuck around for the last week or so without episodes. I, I really, really do apologize. Uh, like I said, Hunger Games has just not been going my way. Uh, I've been streaming a lot. been streaming DayZ and stuff, but not really much action that's worth putting up on YouTube and whenever that does happen I don't want to be one of those people who are like stream highlight whores or anything that just takes highlights from it and uploads it but if it's cool enough that I think you guys would enjoy I'm obviously going to put it up for you guys because that's what I'm here to do I'm here to entertain you guys make it happy and I'm at home. I will see you guys later